Back here in Nineveh Plains, Baghdadi. 2,000 families have returned so far. A lot of these houses haven't been fully fixed because the families actually haven't gotten help. The aid from the different NGOs has been slow. So now we're going to go and see if we can help a few families that have returned who've only partially fixed their homes. This is so crazy. So these four, along with the three husbands, all of them sleep here. That's seven people. Show an answer. Seven people sleep in this room, in this living room, because there's no more bedrooms. It's three families, two sons who are married with their wives that are both pregnant, all of them sleeping here. They fixed one room right here, they cleaned it up, but then they've left the rest of it as the way ISIS has left it, all completely burnt, hoping that they'll get some help to actually do something of it. So this is actually a place that they're living in. This is their condition. You see? You see the room? Yeah. You see the van? The ceiling. It's bare and everything. You see the van? Even here, the wire from the electricity. Completely destroyed. You see, even the window is destroyed. I asked the owners of this house, and I told him, uh, do you are asked uh, some pastors, some fathers, or go to the church? He told me, I go many times, but uh, the church to, uh, to, has they, no told no money. Me, there is no money, we can't will be refixed the burn houses, so that this is uh, your problem, not uh, my problems. And because he uh, rented the houses in Ankawa, and... He haven't money that will be continued to be rented the houses so that he taught me the condition is very bad and the economy is done. So two, there is two pregnant. Both of them are pregnant. Both, bro, both is pregnant. Like how many weeks have happened? Yeah. He used these small rooms, but it's burned. But yeah. just to be, because he used For all the materials as the storage of the Yeah, you see? No door. No door. Yeah. 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 The van. So she had three sons. One of them died three months before ISIS came with a gunshot right here. And now two of her sons who are married live here with her.